Oh, there we go, fish on. That was my first cast right there. <laughs> All right, so what's going on, guys? Welcome back here to another video. As you can see, we're out on the boat here. We are fishing for some sheep's head in some docks here. Um, the weather is not ideal, super windy. It's funny, every time I'm out on the boat, the wind is just howling. And um, the water is kind of cold. It's not too cold though, like last time, but the wind is definitely blowing. We found some nice little coves back here, some nice docks, and um, we're gonna go ahead and try to see if we can catch some sheep's head, maybe some redfish off the docks. I mean, anything that bites will be awesome. So we are out here. I'm using live shrimp. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put you guys on the chest here, and we're gonna go ahead and try some of these docks here and see if we can catch some sheep's head. Let's go. All right, guys, so first things first, show you guys here the rig we got going on. Probably can't even hear me, but got a small little light, got a small little light circle hook, small little split shot, 20 pounds as floral leader. It's kind of light for this situation, but it gets the job done and I think you get a lot more bites instead of using like 30 or 40 pound test um, leader. So, picked up some shrimp this morning, got some nice size shrimp here. I don't like going too big for these sheep said. I like um, smaller to medium sized shrimp here. So what I like to do is I like to pinch the tail off, get rid of that. And then I like to thread the circle hook right through the back here and expose it just like that. Nice little live presentation. Sometimes I hook it up in the nose of the um, head of the shrimp here, but a lot of times I rig it like this and it works really good. All right, just cast it down in there. Gotta watch her line. The way they bite, they bite really subtle sometimes. Sometimes they're very aggressive on the way they bite. So just gotta keep your uh, finger right here on the line and always feel that um that bait, see what they're doing. Got a little tick, got a tick here, got another tick. I'm gonna start pull it, pull it, pulling tension on it. There we go, I think I, I think he's on. He's on, he's on. This is a little one though. Very small one here. Something small, there we go. Cheap said, but a small one. A tiny one, look at this. Nice little tiny one. There you go. Oh, quick release right there. We still got a piece of the shrimp here. We're gonna try to see if we can catch another one with this tiny piece. All right, time to drag down. This is a pretty nice one here. Oh yeah. And I caught that one with a tiny piece, tiny piece. Look at the size of the sheep's head. This is a nice one. Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful sheep's head right there. All right, so we just caught a very nice sheep's head here. Check it out. Look at that guy. 
right off the docks just like it should be. Let me go get the flyer real quick. Alright, check it out. Beautiful, beautiful sheet set right here. This is probably a keeper, but today we're not keeping any, so we're gonna release them all. Alright, here we go. I've been noticing they all are hitting almost out here on the edge. They're not really hitting under the docks for some reason. So. Got one there nibbling on it. That's a good, good hit too. There you go. Got him, got him, back to back right there. Oh yeah. There we go, another one. This one's a little one though. Nice little one here. Nice little dude right there. All right, nice little sheep shed right there. Look at that. Pretty nice. Beautiful colors on them too. Go ahead and release them. Right to the water there. All right, so I think I figured out a little pattern here for them. All right, so I think I figured out a little pattern here for them. They are definitely away from the docks and they're hitting the smaller pieces of bait I'm throwing. That one I caught it with a very small shrimp. The other one came off of a small half of a shrimp too. So I'm gonna be throwing half of a shrimp and I'm gonna be just laying it right off the dock there. Not really under the dock. I'm gonna cast it right there and just bring the bait right out there and let it sink right there. That's where I think they are hanging out right now. The tide is low, so it's coming up. So I think within the next hour or so, they might move under the dock. But I think as of for now, they're hanging out more on the edge here. Look, got another bite. Absolutely, yeah, they're right there. So we got another nice sheep set on right here. GoPro shut off on me, so ah, let's bring it here to the side. This is a big one. Very nice size. Look at this. What a chunky one. Oh, there he goes. Alright guys, so we just pulled in here to another dock. Let's see if this one is a little more productive here. Thing, not even a bite anywhere we're gonna go ahead and head to the beach now and I don't know maybe we'll stop on another spot and do some fishing if not we'll call it a day but overall we caught a couple sheep set that was the goal for today and we made it happen nice little light setup nice little small hook little split shot some leader and you get yourself some nice sheep set um, in the winter time here on the docks with some live shrimp you could also use filter crabs little crabs um, that you'll find along the barnacles here all along these mangrove shorelines you could um find the little filler crabs there and um sheep's head love those too so shrimp and those little crabs will do you perfect for these sheep's head so let's go ahead and um i am going to make a few casts under these mangroves here they look really good um and then we're going to go ahead and head over to the beach for a little bit have some lunch and yeah call it a day man i want to skip a little doa shrimp under these mangroves here for a little bit See if I can pull a, a little snook or something out of here. I'm sure there has to be something in here. See if we can pop something out of these mangroves here. 
Oh, there we go. Fish on. That was my first cast right there. <laughs> nice job. Look at that. That is a pretty nice snook, to be honest. Oh, yeah. Look at that little dude. First cast. First cast. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful little snook. Look at that. Check it out. Nice little snook we just pulled out of the mangroves here. I was just messing around, about to leave this spot, and I was like, hey, let me throw a little DOA shrimp down in there. And two twitches, and he came out and nailed it. Look at that. Nice little snook here. Perfect. Let's go ahead and get the release. Let's go on my finger, broski. Woo! Nice. Right to the mangroves. All right, guys. So now we are going to go ahead and head over to the beach. That little snook was an added bonus, and it was perfect. Came right out of the mangroves, and textbook shot right there. Cast it right in there, skipped it, popped it a few times, and boom, it hit it right along. So caught that nice little snook to end the um, fishing part of the day here, I think. I think I'm probably not going to do any more fishing, but we're going to head over to the beach now. Let Mahi run around, have some lunch, and um, we'll call it a day. Perfect day out here on the water. The day, as you can see, blue sunny skies, so it is perfect. All right, let's go ahead and get out there.